And as far as uh, the top of Outback today, look at that cloud cover in the lower elevations, but also uh, look at that nice snow in the foreground. Now the clouds kind of hugged low, and uh, if you were up above the clouds, well, you did see a lot of blue sky, and it was a, a good day apparently to get out on the ski slopes as we are going to be seeing more snow come our way. But before that, we got a lot of fog to contend with. Look at Lapine, look at Bend, Madras. These are our city cams, and uh, there is a decent amount of fog in a number of locations. Redmond is really getting socked in. That's 97 at Evergreen. And here is what we have as far as visibility is concerned. It's, it's pretty rough. We have the white areas all along uh, 97. That uh, is the quarter mile visibility a little bit better north of Redmond up toward the Jefferson County line, but then it just does get back to that quarter mile visibility again. So please give yourself extra time. We have a dense fog advisory till noon Tuesday uh, from Bend up to Redmond, Prineville towards Sisters, and then up into the Jefferson County areas and central sections of that. Uh, and there could be some possible freezing fog, and that is the fog that freezes on contact, creates that icy glaze. And that is no fun either. Winter is on the way. We're going to be cooler as we head into next weekend. Chance of rain and snow off and on this week, and then uh, we will see some more snow probably on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. But until then, we have high pressure bringing in some cooler air. Do we battle against the cloud cover and spotty showers that are off the coast trying to make it inland? They're not doing it now, but future track indicates that by 6 o'clock tomorrow morning, they will have made landfall, and they're going to be coming across the Cascades at 10 a.m. and into the high desert uh, by about 2 o'clock with a wintry mix through the area. We'll see some rain and snow showers mixed along 97 from, say, 7 to 9 o'clock tomorrow. And then another wave will come through as we get into our uh, Tuesday evening time frame. And then the long-range models have us on the quiet side generally for Wednesday and Thursday. But there is another batch of showers coming in for the weekend, so we'll prepare for that. All right, we've got about a quarter inch of rain expected in Sun River by the time all is said and done Wednesday. We have snowfall uh, that will be in the one to four inch range along the spine of the Cascades. Right now it's 28 degrees and foggy and bend. We had temperatures today in the 30s and 40s, pretty mild in Prineville and Bend at 46. We have temperatures now uh, in the sub-freezing zone, most locations south uh, of Redmond. Right now we have the four Forecast lows getting us into the 20s tonight, and highs tomorrow will be a little bit cooler than we were today, most locations, except for uh, Sun River and Lapine, which were chilly today. All right, so we have a mix of rain and snow off and on throughout the next seven days, and be mindful of that. Keep the rain gear handy and the snow boots. Let's look at your local alert weather.